Christmas every day. Here we have the Armoured Gorgon. So I think this thing here is aimed more at the younger audience. However, a lot of you guys in the comments told me that you wanted me to get one and put it through its paces. And also, my buddy RC Man from Isle of Man, he's really loves the look of these. And he's ordered some and he's really excited about it. And he reckons that I'm really going to enjoy it too. So I've got one and I'm going to give it a blast and see what I make of it. So we've got double wishbone suspension, front and rear with oil filled coil over shocks. However, they do bottom out quite easily. Got a brushed motor, plastic drive shafts, all in all super basic. Battery looks like it goes in from the bottom here somehow. Yep, and it comes with one of these nickel metal nim things, whatever you call them. So that plugs in there, and then that just rattles about in there, I suppose. So controller on and car on. Don't be so mean. Right, so steering, not the fastest, but adequate. And power. For brushed, that doesn't seem too bad. But don't expect to be taking any skin off your grandma's rice pudding. So this body holds on really easy. It's just one giant body clip that just goes through here. And another one on the back. That means no body pins to get ripped off on the outside. Tires, really supple with no sponge in there. So this thing is supposed to replicate a real monster truck. However, a real monster truck has solid axles, four link suspension, four wheel drive. This has none of that. So, eh, I find it difficult to get excited over it. However, I must remember this is supposed to be aimed at the younger audience. <laughs> I think it just makes that little noise just to let you know that you've forgotten to unplug it. But anyway, if we look at this here, the lossy LMT Grave Digger, this one here, just like on the real monster truck, it's got solid axles, four link suspension, and it's four wheel drive. I know the X-Max hasn't got all that, but it's not really trying to. I think this with these sort of tire design and the overall look and everything, I think this is trying to be a real monster truck. Anyway, enough bleeding waffle, you just want to see it rip. And I've got to pretend to be a younger driver, so... Um... <laughs> Staircase of Doom! Oh, well, oh, oh, oh. Right, let's get it out in the real world. Here we are on location. We've got crew in the house. Hello. Hello, hello. Oh, we've got AS back in the house. Got Forrest in the house. What up? What oh, toys yes. he got? <laughs> so he's got his <laughs> X Max <laughs> with the. Oh my god. Oh. Right, bigger than fist size motor. Yeah, it's a big lad. That is like the size of a Coke can, isn't it? That that's is. That's bigger. That's, that is. It was motor wise. Oh my god. That's that's nearly little finger size, just the wires. Yeah, it's six gauge. Oh, that's daft. <laughs> oh, oh have you got it from the right angle? <laughs> it's hard to see he's got wires in the way. Yeah. yeah. But that is wider. That the width for that is that. That's yeah. the width for that motor. And that is. Yeah, so it's actually thicker than that. The plastic chassis brace is no longer yeah. there because it wouldn't go in. Oh. <laughs> so I've trimmed it out there. I've still got that bit. Is it still going to be bashable? Yeah. How long do long. we think the tires are going to last? I These think it's just going to be stop. like one throttle and then that's it, they're yeah, gone. Yeah, look, that's a pinion. <laughs> oh my God. That's the pinion. Yeah, 51 tooth. Anyway, next toys, he has, oh, the legend. This one's, this one's been around for a while, hasn't it? That's the first one I converted to electric, Marky Osho. That's got a max five in it. So as well. You've got about that for over ten years now, haven't you? Easy. Here we've got Stephen's towing technique. Oh look, more crew. Oh waffling. Waffle, waffle, waffle. Look over there. More crew. Oh, yes. They're all getting excited over the gorgon. It's bigger than I thought. That's what she said. <laughs> Ian's admiring this masterpiece, but this one's for a different video. Does he move? Uh, don't, I don't believe no. no. I bet if you take that helmet off, it's just action man under there. Uh, <laughs> do you reckon he's it's got just action clothes. man? He's, he's like, like Barbie, yeah. look, he's just stripping. Has he got anything in that area? Uh, nah, like <laughs> no. I want to see how realistic it is. <laughs> <laughs> he's got pert buttocks. Oh, here we go. Let's see what it's made of. Here we go. Full power. <laughs> Q. <laughs> Q. What's wrong with it? More power. What's wrong with that? More power. 
Oh, well. oh look, Laura's mum in the house for the viewers. <laughs> See if there's like a punch setting on it. Oh, it's only on 50. Yeah, there you go. Oh, here we go, 100%. Oh, here we go. Oh, here, we go. Oh, here we go. Here we go, full power. Well, they're not laughing anymore, so it must be all right now. Anyway, it is aimed more at the younger audience, so it could still be perfect. Let's see what it can do. By the way, you can win this RC car for less than $1 worldwide. See link in the description. He nearly made it. Put it. Here we go, full speed. Oh, he cleared it. Oh. What are you doing, Mr. Noah? So, we're going to hit this jump as hard as possible and try and land on the downslope of that ramp there. A suicide jump? Yeah. Watch out. Okay, I'm going to do it as well. Game over, son. Oh, Game over. Oh. Now look, it works perfectly on the glass. Do you know what? For a beginner, this could be the perfect car. Oh, so we got the GPS on there now. So now we can see how fast it can go. First speed run on glass. Right, let's have a look what she done. Oh, 21 mile an hour. More than enough for a first RC car. Let's see how fast it goes on the concrete. So reset this thing. That is full speed. And by touch. Oh. Right, let's see what she done. 23 mile an hour. Maybe in a future video, if you guys want to see it, we're going to chuck a brushless motor in here and see if we can make it go quicker. Let me know in the comments what motor do you want to see in this car. It's probably quite difficult to see the performance on camera. So here we have Ian's Minimax. What power system you got in there? 6S, but running on 4. All right, 4S, stock, nickel, metal, nim, whatever it's called. And this is Alex's X Max. What are you running in that one? 8S, full house. So you can see that X Max is a little bit bigger, or well, quite a lot bigger actually. Minimax is about the same size. Are you all ready? Ready, steady, go, 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 go! Oh, the Gorgon got off the line the quickest. What? The Gorgon's in the lead. The Gorgon is in the lead and now comes in last. Oh, <laughs> Do you know what? There's not as much in it as I thought because you've got so much power, it's just wheeling and wheel spinning. I want to see if we can do a backflip. It hasn't got much power and it's only two wheel drive. So let's try, see what happens. Oh, oh, oh. Round two. No. Oh, 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 oh. Nope. Recovery. <laughs> footage, footage. No. Oh, no. It definitely needs a bit more power. That's how you do it. Nice. Backflip. Go on in. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Can Gorgon do it? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. What happened? <laughs> Ian is fixing the Gorgon. He's going to try. Monster truck mechanic and RC car mechanic. Supervisor over there. Yep. Through there. 8S over here. Got his X Max out. Is it pinning off? Is it not off? No, it's moved. Oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've got a quicker way. You ready? Go on in. Boom! Back in action. That's quicker, wasn't it? Yeah, that's much quicker. Ian's go. What's it like compared to your X Max? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, yeah, no, I'm, I'm trusting with this. Go on, do something cool. 
What do you reckon though for a kid? It'd be right for a kid, wouldn't it? Yeah. Perfect first RC car. It's not too quick. Oh. So you're not going to cause a massive amount of damage with it. What are you doing? We're sending it to the moon. Oh, we're going to break it for you. To the moon. So they're going to try and take off from there and clear the railing. I don't reckon it will. Oh. Hey! You killed it! <laughs> you came over? Yeah, there they died. Yeah, oh! Breaking it. No more steering! That was a good landing as well. Oh dear. Well, we popped a link off. I think, is it, or is it gears done or survey saver done? Ooh. Survey saver's loose. Ian's going to go and investigate. What's your expert opinion? I think the survey saver's broke. Oh. Well, doing anything. Nah, Body's fixing that. Oh. Let's see what's going on over here. Oh! <laughs> Here comes Alex with his X-Max. Bomb. Go on now, onto the moon. Oh, in the tree. Oh dear. Oh. How's it hasn't come down, mate. Oh, that's properly perched, isn't it? Yeah. Why haven't you fought on brakes? Oh, hey! Hey! Here comes Gaz with a crate in 8S. Nice! Mini Max down there. RC oh, crew in full force today. Meow! <laughs> so, Servo Saber is dead, and it appears we might have to split the whole entire chassis to get to it. I don't know how many screws there are to actually split it. So Gaz has got his Creighton 8S. You've got a YouTube channel as well, haven't you? Yeah, Gaz at RC Fun. What are they going to see on there? I'll I, I tell you what, show us show us what they're going to see on there. Go on then, give us, give us a demo. Well, oh, that launches, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. Oh, now it's back to cut out. Oh. Hey! Alex has made a new friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, what about I chase you? <laughs> <laughs> So now 8S has got his car show out. So what are you running? That's uh, all six. 6S. But right, this can do 8S, can't it? Yep. The Eco Boost oh. Servo in there. Yep. How old's that servo? That's quite a new one. I've started to have troubles with a new Eco Boost. They used to last, but now everyone I put in seems to not last. 8S Kyosho Shruggy, but he's got it on 6S. Waffle, waffle. <laughs> You're waffling yourself. <laughs> uh -oh. oh. She's lively. Oh, really Is that someone sleeping over there? I don't know. Oh no, what's Noah doing? We're going to go flat out across the field and then hit this and just see where it goes. Oh dear. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> That's gone. Oh, oh here comes recovery. Yeah, hey, go and check out Noah's channel. Give him a bit of love. He's building some crazy speed car as well out of wood and 3D print. Oh, that's a chassis bender, if you get that wrong. Oh! Oh, X-Max still going? Yeah. Right, we're going to go off the down ramp of that one and just... Actually, no, there are kids over there. That's not a good idea. I reckon, run up across there and just skim... If you do it at an angle, it should just go up it nice and then just hit that. Yeah, but then it might go in the school and then we'll never see it again. Have uh, we got a recovery team? Rachel? If it goes in the school, is it gettable? No, it's that little... Yeah, he said yeah. <laughs> oh no, guys! <laughs> I don't know what that could have been worse. Oh yeah, it could have been yours, couldn't it? <laughs> there you go. What's that? Ten. Oh, yeah. ten. 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 <laughs> there you go. The Best crash then. of the day. You know what, guys? It's just that bit. Yeah, and I think I've got to stay on at home. Oh. <laughs> Was it a good landing? I don't 
nice. It sounded like a nose landing. I think it's turned off. Oh. Maybe it's landing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there is one of those lurking. Because your mum just stepped in one, didn't she? Yeah. And is there a poo-poo? A poo-poo shoe over there. <laughs> the car's yeah. going to be smelly for the way home. Oh, no. <laughs> You've got to be in there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it tasted it, this one. <laughs> so I think you can see the problem is why it's went off. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. I haven't got it yet. Oh, well, 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 I've been called. Why? What's going on? Dinner time. Dinner time. Oh, We're yeah. going for curry. Get out. It's getting cold. So all in all, great car for a beginner. Probably one of the cheapest cars that you can get from one of the main RC brands. However, for someone that's more used to like the higher-end RC cars, probably not going to really cut it. So... In the next video of this car, we're going to put in a massive power system. This can take 6S LiPos, so subscribe so you don't miss it. And by the way, you can win this car. So if you want to win this car, I'm going to put a link to that down below.